it's Friday and it is definitely a coffee day today. I'm feeling really tired. It's been a long week. Um, today is great and miserable outside. Um, work day for me again, work from home. And nothing else to report really. It's football's on tonight. It's England versus Scotland. But I'm actually going to my sister's to knit and natter, I think, whilst the footy's on. So that should be exciting. Um, not eating my breakfast just yet. I'm not sure what I'm having. I'm not hungry at the moment. Um, it's half seven. Just logging on to work. And uh, exciting news today that 18 to 30s can get their 18 to 30s, should I say, not 13s, can get their jabs. So that's exciting. So Tom should be able to get his, which he's very excited about. And uh, yeah, when I get my breakfast out, I'll show you what I'm having. Tom's got Tom. Uh, Eddie's got a. MOT, a well man MOT at the doctor's, so where have I got my glasses? <laughs> um, I've lost my glasses. Um so yeah, so he he's got that this morning, so I'll probably wait for breakfast till he comes back, maybe. I'm not sure yet. And I'll show you what I'm having in a bit. It's ten o'clock and for breakfast I've got two slices of white bread toasted with some Norpat light on, um some beans and an egg. So this comes to I can't remember, it's over four hundred calories. I have, I didn't make it, Eddie made it, so I've counted it as being 10 grams of the Norpak lighter, even though there might not be. And I've counted half a tin of beans, I'm not sure if there is or not, so I've just covered myself by doing that. It's quite high calories, but it is 10 o'clock, so this will probably be like a brunch, and I probably won't have a full lunch later. So I'll catch you next time I have something. Good evening, it is Saturday, and I've not vlogged at all. I didn't vlog on Thursday or Friday because work was crazy busy. I started off vlogging, did my breakfast, and then just did not get time to do anything else. So it would have been really boring. It would have been just, I don't even know when I had lunch, to be honest. I had meetings all day on Thursday from half nine in the morning all the way through till about half four. And it was just crazy. And then yesterday wasn't much better. Today I got up and I did have for my breakfast today a scrambled egg with a cob, a white roll, and that was it. And then I went into town with my sister, didn't record anything, it was really busy. Um, so yeah, I went into town with her to look for a Father's Day gift and came back pretty empty handed. It's Ewan's birthday on Tuesday, so I managed to get his birthday card. And I think I managed to get like some chocolate for my dad, because that's all I'm getting him really for Father's Day, because not much else I can get him really. And that's it really. So the day's kind of passed me by. I got back, Chloe called in with some Father's Day cards that I'd commissioned her to make. So obviously if, if you follow me before, you know she's an illustrator and an artist. Um, she's actually finished uni now, so she's um, trying to concentrate on her business. So I've ordered some Father's Day cards from her, so she hand delivered them for me. And then um, I nipped to Tesco's, didn't do a food haul because I was trying to put it away whilst I've been cooking dinner. So I've not got dinner out yet, it is. 20 past nine so the day's kind of got away again tonight's meal is a hello fresh meal we've actually cancelled hello fresh again now completely don't think we'll revisit it we're trying to really budget so i think over the next couple of weeks you'll probably start to see more budget meals on my channel so if that's something you're interested in eating healthily on a budget then please stay tuned and subscribe if you haven't already um what else have i got to report on so yeah this one i froze the sausages i froze two of the hello fresh meals from last week Oh, that's the oven now. So yeah, I've got those to eat, and after that, there's no more HelloFresh. I've got obviously the recipe cards so I can reuse them, but I'm not um, subscribing anymore. We just had too many substitutions and stuff, so we just weren't happy. So we've cancelled it. Um, like I say, this Tuesday, it's Ewan's birthday, so we'll be eating out for that, and obviously tomorrow's Father's Day. So I'm sure on both those occasions, there'll be extra food and not really sort of like calorie counting as such. Um, tomorrow should be my weigh day. I'm like that about weighing because um, I've been good most of the week and I've worked out a few times this week, but I just don't feel, I feel bloated, don't feel great on it. But we'll see what happens tomorrow. So anyway. Good morning. It is Monday and it is the 21st of June. Um, today is the start of a fresh week. I'm on holiday tomorrow because it's Ewan's birthday. So tomorrow will involve eating out and treats. So I'm going to try and have quite a good day on calories today, quite a low calorie day if I can, so I can kind of like make up for anything that might happen tomorrow. <laughs> 
So I've started with my breakfast, I've just recorded it, so I've inserted that clip here. And um, I shall, I've got a meeting at eight o'clock this morning, so it's gonna be quite a busy morning from the, from the get-go. So I probably won't have a chance to pop back on until lunchtime, and I shall catch you then. For breakfast this morning, I've got 45 grams of porridge oats with 200 mils of skim milk and some frozen fruits. And then on the top, I've got some of the zero calorie my protein golden syrup. So this is a total of 278 calories. It's 10 o'clock and I've just come out of the meeting. So it's been over two hours and I've got a lot of work to do as a result of the meeting and I already have quite a lot to do. So it's gonna be another busy one. Obviously I'm off on holiday tomorrow and annual leave. So I've got to try and get as much done today as I can. Feeling slightly stressed with it all, so um, whilst I'm not really hungry because I had my porridge, I am feeling like I need to snack. So I've helped myself to some Jaffa cakes. I've actually got four, which may seem greedy, I know, but they're 53 calories each, so I'm going to put them into my app, so I'm going to count them. And I think lunchtime I'm going to pop to Morrison's to get cake ingredients because I'm making you a birthday cake for tomorrow. And then after work, I need to exercise at some point, but I also need to make his cake. So there's still a lot to do and I'm not quite sure where I'm gonna find all the time to do it all in, but I just need to get my head down and focus. So I'm gonna have my Jaffa cakes and a cup of tea, and then I'm gonna pl like plod on with what I've got to get done. And then I'm probably gonna pop out around 12-ish, something like that, just so I can get the cake ingredients and I've got them in. Because then as soon as I log off work, I could, potentially I could quickly make the cakes, get them baked, then do my workout. So it's just a matter of working out timings for it all. But anyway, I'm going to go and eat my Jaffa cakes and I shall catch you in a bit. I thought I'd just jump on rather than just editing. Um, that roll wasn't great. The top of it was alright, so I ate the top half of the roll with some tomato mozzarella and basil. Um, I didn't eat the bottom half of the roll and I didn't eat all the pesto because that was like, spread on the bottom part because it was really, really soggy. It's like someone hadn't drained the mozzarella, so I can't eat soggy bread. So all that's left, so I'm going to eat the new barges, I think, if they taste okay. So just thought I'd let you know it's reduced the calories down to, I think, 551 according to my working, which obviously is only a guess, but as close as I can get. Evening, since last time I saw you I have logged off work, I did my workout, I'm on phase two of the Beach Body Nine Week Control Freak off the wall and it was Tabata or Tabata cardio today. Really quite a tough workout but I really enjoyed it. It was only half an hour long so I've closed all the rings on my watch, came, I came back, I was already here, had a shower and then we took Lou and Luna out for a walk, it was only a quick one because it was raining and actually quite chilly. It's hard to think that we were walking around in sort of like little vest tops a couple of weeks ago because it was so hot and then I've got my winter coat out today. I mean, it's not a thick winter coat, but it's a winter coat with a hood because it is not very warm and it's horrible. Anyway, I've got back and I've booked somewhere for us to go to eat for dinner for Ewan's birthday tomorrow. And I've just made the batter for his cakes and I have licked the bowl. But um, I'm doing the same cake I did last year because he really enjoyed it and he asked for the same one again, which was a salted caramel cake. So I'm hoping it turns out okay. Um, this is one off the Jane's Patisserie website, I believe. Um, I bought some um, Rolos, some little caramel nibbles and some munchies to put on the top. So hopefully it'll turn out okay. It's fairly easy, it's a, a kind of like, a, it's a a sponge that's got light brown sugar in so it should be sort of quite caramel flavoured already and then on the top you make a buttercream that you mix some of the um, the caramel you get in a tin like the condensed milk type caramel the I can't really call it something delish but anyway you mix some of that in and then you also dribble some over the top and then you decorate it with sweets so it's not too bad it's in for 25 minutes once that's done I need to really push on making tea today I took out a steak slice which is like a pie um, and that's in the fridge and then uh, at the moment I took it out of the freezer and I've got some crispy potato slices to go with that that'll be for you and, and whoever wants it um, I've took some mince out because we had a hello fresh meal which I froze which is for some kofters so I don't know what I'm having yet I might have the kofters I don't know what the state of the stuff is that was in the bag with the uh, mince beef for the um, hello fresh meal 
it might have all gone bad but I'm gonna have a look and see what I can sort out from that so yes so that's the plan for dinner a bit of a mixed match but ma mixed mash mixed match anyway it is what it is tomorrow I'm off work on holiday for the day I could do with really logging back on and just finishing a few bits off tonight but my thought is that if I do that I kind of lose the benefit of taking the day off because I already worked more than enough hours last week to cover my day off anyway and I'm using holiday for it so whilst I'm tempted to do it I'm going to try and not do it because it's a bad habit to get into so I'm going to try and be restrained I don't think I showed you my little cupcake I made a little crochet cupcake um, last night which is quite cute and it's gone a little key ring so when I go back upstairs I'll try and remember to show you that um, I can't currently play my Assassin's Creed game on the Xbox upstairs because the disk drive stopped working so I've installed it on Chloe's Xbox which is downstairs in the front room um, so I could do with playing on that really because I really want to get that game finished I've been playing it since November but because I get so little time to play I'm really like struggling to, to get through it but by the time I sit down, I'm normally too tired and just want to relax and just watch a bit of YouTube or something. Anyway, I've been blathering on for about three minutes about stuff that you're probably not even interested in. Um, it's Prime Day today too, so um, I need to have a quick look on there and see if there's any bargains to be had, um, because I've just not had a chance today so far. Um, not that I've got a huge amount of money to spend because of Ewan's birthday, but I might have a quick look and see if I can get some bits, like a tripod for my phone and stuff like that, just so that it makes this a bit easier, because at the moment, I'm always having to hold my phone, so uh, so yeah, I might have a quick look at that whilst I'm waiting on my cakes. I just need to quickly go and wash up. I think the dishwasher needs emptying. <sighs> Sometimes it feels like a never-ending task, doesn't it? But anyway, I shall catch you in a bit when I either get the cakes out and I'll show you them, or I am making dinner. Here is the finished dinner for 752 calories. I'd say this is probably the least favourite HelloFresh meal I've made. The couscous is a little bit sort of sticky and clumpy. The costas, the kofta kebabs are really small and I cooked them for the right amount of time and look quite overdone. And the mint had already turned so it's, it should have mint through there and it should have mint in there and it hasn't. So I've put a little tiny bit of mint sauce in just to flavour that. But I've got no idea what it's going to be like so um, we shall see. Anyway, it's really late now. It's nearly quarter past nine, I've not sat down yet. My cake is made and I've iced the outside edge. I haven't piped the top yet and I haven't drizzled the caramel and put the, the sweets on top. I think I'm gonna leave that till tomorrow. So um, I'm gonna go and eat my dinner, take Eddie his dinner up. I should might make myself a cup of tea first and then go and sit down because my back is killing me at this point. <laughs> so um, I don't think I'll be having anything else to eat because this will be the last thing I have. I have had a bit of frosting whilst I've been making it, but um cook's privileges and all that so this will be me done for the day so i shall see you again tomorrow for the next one bye for now okay thank you It is Tuesday today and I've got the day off work. It's Ewan's birthday so we've just been out. We've been up to Junction 28 because that was his choice of where he wanted to go shopping. And then um, we've come back, we've joined the gym and then we just picked up McDonald's for lunch. It's, an, it's a not calorie counting day for me. I definitely will be over my calorie allowance today. And I know I could count and try and keep it within but I'm not going to. So I'm just gonna enjoy it. I made bacon and pancakes for breakfast and I had a croissant and um, we're having tea out tonight and the place we're going to doesn't have a huge menu um, at the moment it's it's a limited menu so i'm just gonna have what i like and that's it so um, on my way back home now i'm gonna finish off making you and cake that i started making last night and that's it really that's my update i didn't vlog anything up at junction 28 mainly because you didn't want me to did you he won't even answer me he's, he's just sitting there quietly um and i'll catch you later Hi, so I'm back in the car again. My days off always seem to be the same, but I'm currently waiting for Tom, who's gone for his first vaccination. So it's been a day's holiday, mostly spent in a car so far. 
Um, when I go back, I've got to try and finish off Ewan's cake because I still haven't done it. So I literally got back after doing the gym membership and McDonald's. It's got from McDonald's. I had a Big Mac meal, just a medium one, and it was just what I needed actually. I was getting hungry. So I've got a real twitchy eye. I don't know why. I don't know if it's a stress thing, a stress trigger. But oh, my aircon's just kicked back in on my car. Um, I've got a dodgy eye and I've got like stress points in my back again so I think it's work that's caused it so it's a really good job I've got the day off. We're not eating out until quarter past eight tonight so hopefully my food will keep me going till then. Um, if not I am sorting the cake out so I'll probably have a slice of cake. Nothing much else to report really. Um, no, nothing else to report. It's just a dreary day. I'm sitting looking at other cars in a car park so I'm going to sit and probably watch a bit of YouTube or something while I'm waiting. Hopefully it won't be too long. I think it's appointments in two minutes. We've got here probably like five, ten minutes before. So I shall catch you in a bit. Thursday today and I've not recorded much this week. I don't know if there's any footage before this or not. I need to go through and have a look. But I certainly haven't done any complete what I ate in a daze. So it's been an odd one this week. Monday. Um, I think I was alright on Monday. I'm trying to think back to what I did on Monday. Um, it was just a really mad busy day. And then Tuesday I got the day off on holiday. And I didn't really vlog very much of it, if anything. I didn't really vlog my food because it just... I wanted to spend some time with the family and just enjoy Ewan's birthday and Ewan wasn't keen on me vlogging anyway because he doesn't like to be on the film or the camera. So I've got a really itchy nose today, my hay fever is terrible. Um, and then yesterday work was just mad. I've got two meetings and, and this is the problem I've got at the moment is when I'm vlogging. Obviously my life is working from home anyway and it probably will stay working from home really. Um, but there's just not much going on because work is so busy that's pretty much all I'm doing. Yesterday after work, I did choose Jobs Junction 28 yet again with Ewan because he wants to spend some of his birthday money on some trainers for the gym. Um, but it was a mad dash up there, a mad dash back. I met Chloe and Ethan for a Starbucks last night. Um, but again, it just didn't feel vloggable. Um, Chloe's really, really like, de not depressed, that's, that's a strong word, although she is not doing very well at the moment because she's really struggling. She can't get any kind of job whatsoever. <laughs> So she finished uni um, and she's got a degree, which is great. There's no jobs whatsoever for her line of work and she's just struggling to even get any part-time work. So she consequently has no money whatsoever. So she's really down, bless her. So uh, I don't know what she's gonna do. It's, it's odd times we're in. Everyone keeps telling you on the face of it that things are picking back up after the virus and stuff, but it doesn't always appear that way. So I've got Ewan also looking for part-time work because he's left school and he hasn't got anything yet either. So it's odd times really for all. So yeah, um, I've just made my cup of coffee and put the washing machine on. You should have seen in my time lapse. Luna's sitting cleaning herself here. So if you can hear, I do apologise. I don't know if you're able to see her or not. Hang on a sec. She's just sitting here. Ewan, yeah, say hello. <laughs> Licking her paws and just having a good old chew. Oh, she's not very happy about the camera being on here either. So, you're so trumpy. Anyway, I'm going to go upstairs and do some work now because it is nearly five to eight. So, I just feel exhausted. So, I'm really sorry that I haven't vlogged a huge amount and haven't done much what I in a day is. But in all honesty, I either haven't been completely on plan or there's been nothing worth watching. So, I'm going to hopefully rectify that. I'm going to hopefully, now I've got my new tripod, which I'm using now. I'm hoping I'm going to be able to start recording some meal prep again and stuff like that. So keep watching. You might get to see some of that. Not today, but at some point when I've been shopping. And I shall catch you later when I have breakfast. Just need to quickly show you this one. All snuggled up on this bed, really comfy and cosy. The only thing is, as soon as someone walks past the window, she starts barking. <laughs>
hello because I've not vlogged at all today it's now five to four on Thursday and um, I showed you a photo of my breakfast because it was very noisy in the kitchen and then I haven't done anything since then um, breakfast was quite high in calories um, wasn't then hungry for lunch and I've worked through and then I got really peckish about half an hour ago and I've had a slice of Ewan's birthday cake and some minstrels and now feel very sick and very guilty <laughs> but I should have had lunch but didn't and then Eddie offered and I wasn't hungry and then by the time I was hungry I've been too busy to go and make anything. Work's mad again as always. Cup of tea with dribbles down the back. Um, hoping to go out for a walk with Luna in a moment um, and then um, I'm going to carry on working until I go out. I promise you and I'll go to Decathlon with him because he wants to get some tops for the gym so we're going to go and have a look over there but it's open till 8 and the traffic's always busy over that way now that traffic's back to normal um, until after 6 so I said we'll go about half 6 and um, something like that so whether we have a quick wander around Ikea while we're over there and get a hot dog I don't know from a diet point of view this week isn't going to plan and isn't going very well I haven't got a few, huge amount of healthy choices left in and I'm not going shopping until the weekend at the earliest so it is what it is um, at the moment it's just not my priority I, I want to really lose the weight but all the stuff's going on it's taking priority over it so I'm still vlogging so I'll just keep you in the loop as to what I'm doing so when I sit crying that I'm fat you'll know why <laughs> anyway um, I shall catch you in a bit hopefully when I next pick up the camera here's tonight's dinner so I can't remember what the calories are, it's about 700 calories. Um, so this is butternut squash risotto made in Instant Pot. I've weighed out all the rice and everything. Um, I forgot the count of bacon but it came out at 643 calories and I put, I think it was three slices of bacon between, well there's four portions. So um, I've counted the, the, the dough balls, these are the Pizza Express ones that I managed to get reduced. Bit of a rip off though, even though it's only 54p. There's only seven dough balls in here. So I've got three. And it says on the back that half a pack, which would be four, would be 130 calories and 55 for half the garlic butter. Well, I haven't had half the garlic butter and I haven't had four dough balls. So I've counted three quarters of a portion in the app in the hope that that's about right. So it is what it is. I've still got about 300 calories left, but I didn't count my minstrels and cake I had earlier. So I am over for calories for the day, really, I think. But um, I'm not too worried today and I shall catch you later. Good morning, it is Friday at long last. Another work from home day for me. Just got up and got downstairs. Well, I've logged on. I'm just making my cup of coffee now. It's quarter to eight, but a bit of a late start for me today. Just so tired. I went to bed early last night as well. I went to bed about half ten, twenty to eleven. Good morning, Una. It's camping outside. And um, yeah, so it's been another busy week and Generally, I'm feeling a little fed up, a little bit down, if I'm honest. I think the way of the world just isn't going my way. I don't know if I mentioned on here that our TV stopped working the other day. Um, Ewan's birthday, went out, came back and the TV's not working. So I've got to look for a new TV, so it's more expense and just gets me down really. So, anyway, um, it's going to be another really busy day of work. I've been really rubbish at vlogging and rubbish at remembering to record my food and stuff and I haven't been on plan very well so I apologise but I thought I'm still going to keep vlogging because it kind of keeps me semi in control and also just so you know what I'm doing and keep you up to date if you're interested. So we haven't got a huge amount of food in either. I really need to do a food shop so I'm going to have to do that this weekend um, at some point. I won't be doing it today. So I'm not sure what we're having for dinner today. Last night I made the risotto, which was something I just made out of nowhere. Oh, let me just adjust my coffee machine because this one's made the mug set in. That's it. Um, it was delicious actually. It was really, really tasty. When I used Primula, it was really cheesy and creamy, so it was really nice. And it was done in the instant pot, so it wasn't faffing around with a stove, ladling one spoon of stocking at a time or anything like that. So really enjoyed it um it feels a bit cooler this morning it feels quite nice yesterday um when we went for a walk at the park it, it got really close it started raining but it got really close like it was another thunderstorm but 
a little bit fresher this morning, but it's hard to know how to dress at the minute because you put your jeans and the top on and then you just end up feeling really hot in the afternoon, but I'm not gonna moan because obviously it's nice to still be able to get out and about and it has been generally a little bit drier. So I think the forecast is supposed to change and turn nicer again. So I hope you can hear me from my coffee machine. But yeah, there's not, not much content going on at the moment. So I thought I'm just having a bit of a chat at the start of the day and then trying to record food or take posts of my food depending on whether I'm in meetings or not. So I hope that's okay. And I shall catch you when I have my breakfast in a bit. For breakfast, I've decided to go for 45 grams of this granola. I think this is from Aldi, this one and it's 189 calories for 45 grams and I'm going to have one of these protein pots from Lidl and I can't remember the calories on this one per serving 130 but it's a high protein one so hopefully it should fill me up I'm contemplating putting some extra fruit on there as well it'll be frozen fruit because I need to go shopping so I'll see what I've got and what this looks like when it's dished out here is my breakfast. So this is the 45 grams of the granola, the strawberry Milbonna protein pot, and I've got 77 grams of frozen pineapple on there too. And I think this comes in around 354 calories. I'll put it on screen. I just keep sneezing, so I sound very nasally this morning, so I do apologise. And I shall catch you later. It's 20 past 11 and I'm getting peckish, so I'm having one of the white chocolate and raspberry bliss bars for 99 calories. It's lunchtime now, it's five past one. I've just come off a call and not in a good place today mentally. I've spent most of the morning crying on and off because work's just rubbish and life generally is rubbish at the moment. But anyway, I've decided for my lunch, I'm gonna have a beef and vegetable chunky soup from, I think it's Aldi, this one. It's either Aldi or Lidl. And it's 208 calories for the entire tin. I'm really hungry, so I'm having a bagel thin with it as well. That's from Aldi. That I think it's 120 calories. So I've planned it all in. I've also planned my tea in as well. So for tea tonight, I've took some chip shop curry chicken kevs out of the freezer that I bought reduced. 45p for two um, a couple of weeks ago. So I've bought, got those both out and I've got some extra fried chips. So I've planned all that in and it works out that I've got about 200 calories left for the day. So hopefully I'll better have some sort of snack later. But right now I'm gonna have my bagel and my soup because I am starving. Here's my soup and here's my thin bagel. I've just got a layer pack on there, 10 grams. I've, what I did, I zeroed it, then spread the layer pack on so it would weigh it. So 10 grams of layer pack lighter on there, and I've still got, I think it's 222 calories left um, after I've put my dinner in. I haven't put any veg on with my dinner, I've literally put my chicken kiosk and some chips, so I might need some veg, but they don't, normally they're not a huge amount of calories. So hopefully I should have a bit of a snack later too, hopefully. And I'll catch you later. a rubbish day today so Ewan was on the way back from the gym and he asked if I wanted anything from the bakery so I said get me a silver roll and a cake because I need something to cheer me up which I know isn't the answer anyway he didn't go to the bakery he went to the corner shop and he bought me a big bag of Harry Bows, which I had a handful of and then I gave them to Tom but then he got me a big galaxy bar and I'll just show you it's in the door next to me it is a how big a bar it is actually 110 grams bar and I've got that left so I've eaten probably I think six squares which six squares hang on a minute look. probably 12 squares actually and six squares is 120 calories so it's like probably all my calories that I have for my treat extra and because I thought I was going to go and eat more of it, I've actually made myself two slices of toast with some light low pack on and eaten that. So I'm going to really be over calories today. And I'm really crossing myself and frustrated, but I need to look at the, getting a different job. <laughs> Just sort of keep you up to date on where I am and what's on, what I'm up to. Like I say, it's 10 to 5 and I'm still working, but I've done since half 7 this morning. Looking at working this weekend again, which sucks a little bit. And I did spend most of the day on and off in tears because I'm fed up. So 
tomorrow will be a fresh day. I'm going to try and stick to plan with my food tonight and I probably will still go for a walk with Ian even though it looks pretty miserable outside. I haven't got any plans to work out because my sister's away so just thought I'd give you an update and I shall catch you later for tea. Good morning, apologies for the bare face. Just got out of the shower not long ago, made myself a cup of tea which I thought I'd wait for my coffee for a little bit. Um, it is currently five to six and I'm up ready to work for a little while. Um, I'm actually going out with my sister this morning to go and visit my mum and dad. Um, we've decided it's sometimes better to go in twos because then one of us can talk to mum and one of us can talk to dad. So that's the plan for this morning. But obviously I've got a lot of work to get done this weekend so I thought I'll get up early, get started on it, hopefully get a couple of hours in before I go out and then... I have got to go food shopping at some point today. I think Ewan wants to go to the food warehouse and possibly home bargains, so I might be doing that. Um, but I do need to get a plan in place for food for this week, so I'm actually like planning my food properly. Yesterday went downhill rapidly, and I ended up having a bit of a binge last night. I ended up eating a big bar at the Big Bar Galaxy. I finished it off, had some crisps. You name it, I had it. So I don't feel particularly proud of myself today, and I just... Even during the night, I had a real restless night because of work, but I, I kept thinking about becoming fat and putting all the weight back on that I've lost. So I've really got to knuckle down this week and do something about it because I've really got myself to blame. So that's what I intend to do. So I'm going to get on with some work now and uh, I'm not planning on eating just yet. I don't even know if I'm going to eat before I go out. I'm not quite sure yet. I'm going to see what happens. Um, I have got some of the Perufki sausages, the Polish sausages, but to be honest, I just don't fancy them. So... I might leave those for Eddie to have. Not sure yet. I shall keep you posted. Like I said, I've not got a great deal else in. I've got porridge and cereal, but I've got no eggs. And not a lot else. So, if I have anything, it'll be cereal. So, we shall see. And I shall catch you in a bit. Here's my breakfast. So, I've got three of the, um, the sausages, the Polish sausages. This weighs out at 92 grams and I've put the calories into my app because you can actually scan these in. I've also got 7 grams of tomato ketchup, 5 grams of this Polish mustard and I've got a slice of bread with 5 grams of low fat lighter on there. And this comes to a total of 395 calories and I shall catch you later. For lunch I've got a small lunchtime portion of chips and a little mini sausage and some gravy and I've got a slice of bread and butter with it. Hi, not vlog much today. So I went down, oh, I did some work this morning, I did about two and a half, three hours. I'm about to go and do some more in a second. I'm just gonna sit down while I talk to you. Um, my sister then picked me up and we popped down to visit my mum and dad. We were down there for a couple of hours and then we nipped for a coffee on the way back. Sorry about my washing over there. Um, and then after that, I got home and you and I nipped to um, the food warehouse. I didn't record a, a shopping haul. I just bought a big bag of lean mints, big bag of um, chicken strips for the boys. I bought a big massive pack. I think it's five kilos of chicken breasts um, Frozen veg frozen stir fry veg stuff like that Didn't get any salad stuff and did spend about 90 something pounds. So I've still got to get some salad stuff Just to last us for this week um, I went to home bargains and bought some more protein powder because I'm out of it and obviously the boys are going to the gym now So they want some and if I do any workouts, I sometimes do have it just to make um, whatever I'm having more filling. <clears throat> um, what else I forgot to tell you? I'm supposed to be going over to my sister's to do some crochet or knitting tonight, but I'm not sure when yet. It's now nearly two o'clock, and I, like I said, I would like to get another sort of three hours work done if I can. Um, you just saw what I've had to eat. So I had a lunchtime mini chips. Um, it was in a tiny box. So it was mini chips, sausage, and gravy. So on the app, I've managed to find the mini chips. Um, I've managed to find a chip shop gravy, but I couldn't find a sausage that wasn't battered. And it wasn't a battered sausage, and it was only a small sausage as well. It was like probably not quite half the size of a normal sausage from a battered sausage from a chip shop. Maybe a three quarters of that, maybe. So I've just put a thick sausage in that's been fried or whatever. So I don't know if that's right or wrong. I'm on an easier day today. So with my breakfast and my lunch, I think I've still got about a thousand calories for tea. Not too sure what I'm going to have for tea yet. <clears throat> um... I bought the boys in Iceland 
like this dirty, it's either dirty pasta or dirty waffle thing, but I didn't buy it for Eddie myself, so I don't know what we're going to have yet. I need to have a look and a rummage to see. Like I said, I've got chicken and stuff, so I'll come up with something. But because um, I don't think I'm eating at my sister's tonight, I'm not sure yet. But that's today so far. I didn't vlog when I was out and about because certainly mum and dad's I didn't, and then I just did. I've completely just forgot all about it really. So apologies. I'm going to go and do some work now and I shall catch you in a bit. Good evening. It is quarter to 11. <laughs> it's very late. Um, I went over to my sister's and we had, we shared a Marks and Spencer's Japanese meal, which was spicy, but it was really nice. And she bought some custard slices. So I had one of those as well. So I've been a right fat pig, but it is my uh, easier day today. I don't know where I am calorie wise. Cause I don't know how many calories were in the, the Japanese meal, but really enjoyed it. So I did some crochet, so I've crocheted the body of an owl. So I'll show you that when I finished it. Um, so yeah, and I finished off making one of the little stars that um, that I made a few weeks ago and put a keyring holder on for my sister and gave her that. So we had a really, really nice evening actually. We sat and watched a programme called Task Mas Taskmaster, which is a Sky programme, so I don't have access to Sky at home. So it was very, very funny. And we had a quite an entertaining evening and just nattering, so it was good. Um, tomorrow I'm up early, Tom's up early for work but I'm up early because I want to try and get some more work done which sucks a little bit and um, you want to pop to Catalan and at lunchtime I'm going to play bingo at a social club um, not that far away so <laughs> full on day out planned, it almost feels like we're back normal doesn't it, a little bit, little bit, little bit more normal so I can't get my words out, I'm obviously tired because I've been up since like, well I was in the shower at half five so it's been a long old day. So I'm just sitting down watching a bit of YouTube, my TV obviously doesn't work so I'm just sitting watching on my iPad and I shall be going to bed in a moment. So this is probably the last bit of footage going into this weekly vlog and I shall probably start a new one tomorrow and I shall catch you again soon. Thank you for watching, take care, bye.